you know how nice it is that you two are cousins? Yeah, you two. Oh, oh, you know that. That. I didn't know that. Oh my god! Yeah, you know, yeah, I, I was listening to one of your episodes, and you just give me like familiar energy. I was like, this is just like us. So yeah. now knowing that you're cousins, it I was makes like, sense. Okay, yeah. I love it. Yeah. Oh, oh my familiar god. energy oh my is god. cute. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, we love it. So we're basically yeah. all like podcast cousins. Yeah. 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 Obsessed. So have you, did you guys like grow up with each other? Yeah. yeah. Oh my god! Oh, yeah, like uh-huh. seven years old doing dance routines. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Who's older? Me. Oh. Yeah. Oh, wait, how, wait, how old are we? How old are we all? I'm th- I just turned 30. I'm 33. I'm 31. Oh. I'm 27. Do you know oh. what? I'm, <laughs> I'm so happy to be around 30 year old girls. Oh my God. Everyone's always like, I'm 26. So I'm I like, oh, know. I know. I know. Oh my yeah. God. <laughs> we had like a whole meltdown about me turning 30 like three months ago. Oh. Like the whole group was turning 30 and they like, were all just going through the motions. <sighs> And I was just like, yeah, we've been there, done that. Three years <laughs> in. Once you get to the other side, it's absolutely fine. I honestly, so I, nothing's changed. Like, you don't yeah. feel any different, do you? I just feel like so up from 30, what can we 30 do? and thriving. Thrive. Yes. 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 Oh my God, it can only get better. Yeah. 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 I will. Honestly, what it else will. can happen? I went through everything else. It's all right, we can survive. <laughs> Today we have another cousin duo. We've Woo! got Prinny and Amber in the building. Hello. They're our first cousin duo. <laughs> I feel oh so God. honored. I feel so honored. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah. Girlies, introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Prinny. And I'm Amber. And, and we, we are, are Styling City Diaries. Diaries. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. What's up? Oh, you guys, it's improv. giving me Sex in the City vibes. I swear to God. I love that it, it's giving yeah. that. What's it, you that guys' like, like podcast intro? Um, oh, <clears> okay. Hi guys. guys, and welcome back to another episode of Style and City Diaries. Brought to you by your favourite and fabulous cousins, Pretty Ray and Amber Lowe. Yes! yes. <laughs> I literally <laughs> almost forgot. I was like, I what is want. the interest? It's because we're so on opposite sides. Yeah, and stuff. Also, you're not in your normal habitat. Yeah. I was like, yeah. damn. Yeah. Well, we got it, we got it. Got no, it. guys, yeah. that's a banging intro. <laughs> <That's laughs> bang. You know us two, we fumble it all the time. Well, let's start again. Let's start again. I'm like, oh, fine, you do it this time. You just have to. Yeah, we used to fumble it a lot. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we just got oh, it. Oh, is oh, that me or that's you? me. Phones on silent, silent girls. Come on. Silence. <laughs> not being <laughs> professional. <laughs> Should we do our podcast intro? Yeah. yeah. Oh my God. I don't even. I feel under pressure now. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> three, two, one. One, two, three. Hi everyone, welcome back to the Oversharers podcast. My name is Carlton. And I'm Hava. And, and today we've got a brand new scenario. Woo! I love it. This <laughs> ours is basic. Yeah, me, yeah. Now now they, they, said, now they said cousin duo, they, they were giving bombs. What do you is know this? what I mean? And they had <laughs> we need to go back to Creative Corner. They had bits <laughs> where they were like in sync. We, no, no, we weren't in sync. No, I'm that's it. Space. No, no, I'm, I'm practicing, practicing this week. But the reason why we kept saying, having to say cousins is because people were like, oh my God, you're cousins. But you've been listening to the podcast for so long. Like, where did you yeah. miss it? So and it's so annoying when someone's like, oh, yeah, you and your friend. And I'm like, oh, don't say that. That's my blood. That's my blood. That's my blood. Yeah, I'm like, that's jarring. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, anyway, yeah. We get like, what do we get? We get besties, besties we get sisters, friends, sisters, friends. And then we get random cousins. people say, like, oh, how do you guys know each other? Like if you were listening to us from if you were diehard fans, you, know you would know we we're cousins that right did now. this from the pandemic. But in we our also bedroom. people don't guess that we're cousins because everyone's like colorist. Yeah. So they're like, how can like a mixed yeah, race girly so have confused. like a black cousin? <laughs> and it's like, mm, <laughs> do the math. No, seeing their faces, so they're like, oh, oh. It's, <laughs> it's gonna be from the obvious <laughs> side of the family. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, mm. someone, <laughs> si- someone's siblings in that family. Yeah. I'm like, um, <laughs> my dad's side. <laughs> Yeah, that makes sense now. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> Should we start off with a crazy scenario or do you guys want some hot topics? Because I want to discuss a few things, but <gasps> I want to like, I don't know, what do you, you guys feel? Do you want a spicy scenario first? But yeah, yeah go on, go on, let's get spicy. spicy. Yeah. Right, this person said, keep me anonymous. Love. Of course I will, darling. We love you. We love your anonymity. She goes, I'm a 23-year-old Muslim girl who got into a relationship with a 35-year-old man about one and a half years ago. She goes, my family also know this man and respect him a lot. He is also married with kids. Wait, what, where's the respect? What? Oh, they respect him outside of the fact that he's with her. 
I would okay, imagine, let's right? Let's read again. <laughs> Wait, she wants to get married to him, but he's already married. She goes, <laughs> I'm so shy. I'm scared. I'm scared. Well, I'm yeah. nervous. I'm worried. <laughs> She's this a baby girl. Right. <laughs> I've read a bit of this. It's actually wild. She goes, my family also know this man and respect him a lot. So I'm assuming they know that he's married with mm. kids. Mm -hmm. Also, in Muslim culture, people... They can marry up to... They can marry up to oh, four yeah. wives. Yeah. But can I just... Go, go. Say something. I feel like that's been taken out of context over years and years and years. Uh, like and now, of course they and now they're things. like, oh yeah, I get full wives and I get to like bang them all as well. No. It wasn't like that. It was like you had a wife, and let's say your next door neighbor becomes a widower, you would take that woman in and like look after her. So then, mm -hmm. like you know, she's got something. Mm -hmm. That yeah. was the whole point of like having multiple. As you are. So if it's like, so, so usually it's the case where like, if there's someone that wasn't able to have children, if there's a widower, then right. a man might take her as a wife for companionship. Um, and also there's the caveat that they have to treat all the wives equally. Yeah. And a and lot of men take they care don't. of them. So yeah. house them. You can't be buying someone a new fridge and like the, the other, other one, one. you yeah. do everything the same. So okay. a lot goes into having four wives. It's not yeah. just having four wives. You can't buy someone a house and not the other one. Yeah, yeah and we can't be doing it in a recession. It's not going to work. No. <laughs> so she goes, going into this relationship, she goes, I knew he was married and he told me that he's looking to marry again. And the reason he likes me so much is because he knows I come from a good family and he knows what a good person I am. She goes, the first question I asked him was, does your wife want you to get married again? He said yes, because she also knows you and she will accept it. Okay. From the start, I knew that I should have gone to his wife and asked her beforehand and said, have, we ha have you had this conversation before? His wife is not born in the UK and only came here around seven years ago. He would always tell me, we talk about you at home and she knows how much I like you and even the children adore you. So don't worry about anything. Oh dear. How Why would you ever that? listen to a man and trust what he says? <laughs> <laughs> I would occasionally visit their house. I would help with everything. His wife really knows about me. Oh. She feels like his wife really knows about me. She goes, his wife would call me over to the house regularly. I would help her with everything, help her with the kids. I would always ask him, does she know? And he would always say yes. And he goes, and she carries on and says that I really love this man and things were supposed to work. She goes, one time I stayed at their house for one night as the kids wanted me to. And even after saying multiple times, because I wasn't comfortable that his wife, he said he's told her it's his house, he owns it, and the lady should stay. What are you saying well, at she's... the house for? Right? It's, it's all it's given like babysitter with benefits. Like yeah. it sounds like she's mm, doing housework. It's given and... nanny. Yeah, 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 yeah like yeah. it's given nanny. Anyway, she goes, it was going all well. I enjoyed being with him and his wife and kids. I did ask him, myself why he wants to get married again he simply said that previously he was in a forced marriage between his wife his previous wife and him and now he wants to be in a relationship where he loves someone anyway she carried on doing what she was doing she goes things became difficult she goes a few months ago he was traveling back home to his country and he asked me to go over to the house as he said the kids miss me and i went over to the house and a few days later i messaged his wife asking if she and the kids are okay and she said thanks and basically stopped messaging me it got to the point where her and the wife <laughs> the wife basically <laughs> said why is this woman keep coming into the house what's going on i mean I yeah it. girl what's going on <laughs> <laughs> anyway so she said she confronted the man and he called her and said to her listen um i've told her about you you need to relax calm down the wife knows about you she goes he then asked me is something go she she goes the woman the wife came to me and she said is something going on between you and my husband mm -hmm. to which um she said yes the wife got angry and she basically kicked her out the wow. husband now calls her up and he's and she basically says to him, why have you not, why have you basically lied to me? Um, she goes, I got really angry and told him, why did you lie to me? And he also says to me that at this time, she knew that we were together. Once he got back to the UK um, and she met up with him again, they had a big argument and everything along those lines. She goes, I also had an argument with him because all the time he was telling me that she knew, but she didn't. Once I got home that day, she messaged me saying that she will never accept me getting married to her husband. 
turn and off. Really yeah. What uh, can we do? She hasn't You're really literally gone about like a 12-year-old. What the hell? Right? She hasn't gone about it in the right way. She goes, this is the first relationship I've been in and oh. I thought of myself, I've already messed up my life now. She goes, oh. I cried. Oh. I forgot she's 23. Yeah. Yeah. She goes, I cried and cried for days until he messaged me saying that he really wants me back and silly me instantly went back to him. She goes, we went out a few times and then would totally, he would basically totally ignore my calls and text messages. The second time he said the same thing, that he can't do this, it's too much arguing. And I said, fine, I was heartbroken, but I left it alone. She goes, he then messaged me again, saying, I really miss you, please let's work on this mm. and let's get back together. She felt like basically she was inclined to, so she went back with him once more. Anyway, she goes, I also said, if you knew that she was never going to accept me, why did you put me through all of this? Mm -hmm. He goes, I still think to this day that one day um, that she's going to accept this marriage. As of now, she goes, as of now, only yesterday, he called me saying that we should stop because he can't handle the arguments and fights every day. I told him, okay, I left it alone. Um, but she goes, I'm still praying that we get back together. Mm -hmm. I felt myself going crazy every day and I tried. And she goes, I cried and I tried every day. She goes, I've become very distant with, from everyone as I want to be with my, she goes, as I want to be with him, but I'm also by myself and I pray and I make dua every day that Allah makes this easier for me. She goes, please let me know um what you guys think he's manipulated her and preyed on the fact that she's young and she's never been in a relationship before yeah. she doesn't have a reference point as to the fact that this is not nice it's not even, i'm trying to i'm trying to be nice because i can really empathize with, with how like we've all been there in situations with these guys and you're going back but only because you don't know any better and you don't know that this is not how someone who loves you should treat you they shouldn't mm. lie to you they shouldn't put you through this situation like her even asking that question like why did you put me through this a man like that can't even answer it no because he, he don't even did know. it for shits and gigs yeah, like, he doesn't even, he's not even aware of what he's doing he's just getting the benefits yeah i just feel really bad also i feel like the fact that she's 23 doesn't help no, no she's very young, she's so young but this is a very character building age mm. you know right. she's gonna look back one day and be like bloody hell i'm glad i went through that look yeah now. i'm glad <laughs> i didn't get married yeah, yeah glad she got trapped by yeah. him but, but i think as well like you know, you know, what's that saying where it's like, oh God, like show me a sign. And he's like, I'm showing you the signs. Yeah. Stop <laughs> ignoring them. Like sis, you're, you're praying to God, but like he's showing you. Yeah. Yeah. Everything yeah. he's doing right, yeah, right yeah, now is a sign. It's a sign that, that you he's not picking to... up that call? Yeah. yeah. Sign. Yeah. It's a sign. The fact that the wife said no? Sign. Yeah. yeah. Oh, bless the poor wife. I like, know. Being in her no, position. Because imagine True, like, yeah. who is this woman <laughs> in my yard? <laughs> like what? Sleeping over. Sleeping over looking after my kids. Like my husband's not even here. And then the girlfriend, I don't even know what to call her. Is she a girlfriend? No. She's like a mistress. <laughs> Oh, she's a no, nanny. She's, oh, yeah. I'm she's, sorry, a, she's in a relationship Sorry, she's in a relationship with, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Relationship with relationship. him. Yeah. He's just not. He's just. Well, he is in a relationship well, he with her. He's an actual liar. Her. Like, the wife is probably looking at her like she's just helping out. Yeah. yeah. Like, maybe like a family friend. Right. Yeah. But then I think the penny probably drops for her when he was out of the country. And she's, and she's coming over. Like, sis, you're not my friend. Yeah, like, <laughs> I don't know why you're still here. But the man is also so deluded, like. <laughs> the like, way that this man got like this, I'm telling you that some men, the confidence that no, no, no. I the is mad. He, he, he got away like with it. Away like with it. The, his mistress. I, I don't want to call her mistress, but his girlfriend. Uh, girlfriend. I don't even want to say side piece, but his girl essentially came to the house where his children yeah. lay. <laughs> And he she was cooking and it. cleaning, guys. Like he was cheating in blind sight. Yeah. Literally. Yeah. Is that not mad? Pain sight, yeah. pain sight, thank you. Is that not mad? And it's crazy. Crazy. And the, and the wife's just going to be like, never bring that woman to my house again. She probably thought she's like a help. Like she's here to help her and support her. I would have thought the wife, though, would have just, you know, the wife and the girlfriend would have just done that Had thing. Had a conversation. Yeah, like done that thing where, you know, the Spider Man's are pointing at each other. And then obviously the wife is a bit more seasoned in the game, sits down the young girl and tells her run for the hills <laughs> i'm not gonna say like, what you think it is stupid, i think mm. she clocked come on like two three times this woman's coming yeah. to the house but and you're why, randomly helping but why didn't the young girl have a conversation i think that's my the biggest but question. she's never been in a relationship and she's young yeah but oh, the thing no is but got, like, the, the confidence yeah like you're in the yard anyway yeah. you'd be like in the kitchen you know making tea like 
Well, what, what are you saying? Like, you, you'll have everything. I'd maybe maybe she's I'd be getting the tea. Well, 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 if anything, I'd be trying to get, like, the tea or something. <laughs> <laughs> like, so funny. She's so like, like, give me the tea. Yeah, yeah like, like, what's, what's your hubby like? <laughs> yeah, like, what do no, I need I to know? How does he like, like, like his me. eggs? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. like so what do you guys do? Like, what's life like? Do something that's, like, hinting, like, hello. What's his love like? Maybe she secretly knew that the wife wasn't on board. Mm. I think and she's that's why she was a bit like treading on eggshells a little bit. Maybe. Yeah, and I think she kept questioning as well. Like, mm, does are he, you does sure? She know, like, she kept she asking, yeah. are you sure? So what happens with the family? Right. Well, they're going to lose respect for him. But I'd go tell mm. my mum and dad this is what he's done, first of all. Yeah. Mm. Shame him in the community. You can't be doing that. Because also, Shame. a man like that, he's probably got another two girls. Oh, on the go. Wouldn't be and he's going to keep surprised. doing the same thing until he's actually put in his place by... We need to call people out. I'm all for public shaming. Yeah. <laughs> get them. Get yes. them dogs. <laughs> Change your behavior. Can I just say, though, for Put the, the microphone, microphone <laughs> on the for the benefit of, like, from, like, just hindsight, <clears throat> this doesn't usually happen. Like, do you know what I mean? Like, yeah. in Islam. This is a very niche. niche. Yeah. Situation. So we always get niche scenarios. Like, this is like. very strange for her to be going Do you to reckon the house? she's, like, a like a UK girl? I think she's from Or, like, UK. a Londoner? Because I'm like, when does this happen? Like, I don't think so. Like this where? isn't very like, UK-esque. No, is it? it's not giving, mm. like... I was a proper imagine it in a UK context. <laughs> yeah, so was I. I'm like, how are you going to my girl's yard? Like, where, like he's gone back home to his... Car. I'm just like... Like, so it's very you, brazen. Yeah, like, where do you not live? No, I feel like, like it's UK, guys. Even the way she types. Really? Mm. Yeah, I don't know. Mm. I Could mean, it be okay. a Londoner? I don't know. I feel like they're... Let us know. Follow up. Yeah, where are you from? I just want to know. No, but you know what? Okay, what? If let's round up. What advice are we giving her? I personally think... Thank God it's mm. over. Yes. Lesson mm. learned. Mm. Yes. Don't like, don't even, no, don't even dwell so on this, better. honestly. Go through the emotions. Obviously, you know, you had feelings, your feelings got hurt and you're sad. But like, you're so much better than that. Mm. And this is like, this is just a little blip. A blip. Mm. Yeah. No, you yeah. know, you, it goes back blip. to what you said about the character building age. Yeah. You've gone through it. Now you know what to do differently. Exactly. Next time you won't let no man try anything. So be like, bet. You know, yeah. I also think she needs to have friends to chat to. I think yeah. she needs to go to the local. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like, if you've got girls, like, you're having a conversation. I think she should go to the imam and say, this is what this man's done. Like, when Shook. you walk in, they're like, oh, yeah, that's the man. That yeah, please. No, 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 <laughs> they definitely gossip. Yeah. Like, if that's around the community, of course they yeah. gossip. But yeah, I let it go around means. the community. But just like, a, as a prof preventative as yeah. a preventative measure oh, so you're that he doesn't to hot him out to the yeah, yeah, yeah to the community so that he doesn't go around doing this to other mm. girls valid valid like other yeah. women's daughters like people who think this is a respectable man in the community he ain't mm. letting oh, him into yeah. their homes do you know what I mean he's trifling because he's letting the girl into <laughs> his I'm actually being real <laughs> isn't it though he's proper trifling that is <laughs> that's trifling that's <laughs> nuts not a sleepover <laughs> we're you actually being really, really nice always. the kids want you to stay who he actually them? told who are, these kids? Are kids? who are these kids and these why do they have kids. a say now they're saying where's what? auntie where's auntie like, yeah, what who, just, who do they think she Listen, is guys we're forgetting how deep <laughs> this is he's infiltrated her into the house that's, that's so wild because she's yeah. wearing her silk nighty what <laughs> I want to know where does she sleep? Yeah. Yeah. She was sleep? it a spare bedroom, the sofa, mattress on the floor? Because if she slept on the like sofa, that's disrespect or something. Mad. It's crazy. It's already, already Sleeping on the house on its own, like it's just mad. Regardless, I wouldn't. Th I wouldn't stop there. What did the wife think when, when she, she had stayed to, over? When she had to bring out the bed sheets and, and everything, stuff? and here's your towel for the morning. If you need anything, here's a glass of. Water. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Did she get up for the kids and make breakfast for them in the morning? Oh. Well, she was helping out, so mm. yeah. she's probably making breakfast for everyone. No, I can't go. Oh, I'm sorry, doing that at 23 is mad. Also, she went back to him a few times, didn't yeah. she? Oh, I really hope she doesn't her. go back to him again. Yeah. You know, You're we've all done that, that though. We've yeah. all, yeah. Yeah. all yeah. done that. You've had your two tries now. Yeah. Yeah. So it's not worth going, yeah. So allow it. So let it go. <laughs> Bloody, yeah, what a start, girls. Yeah. <laughs> I'm all warmed up. I know. Really? Wow. Wow. <laughs> really? so I want to know what you guys thought about the Amale situation. Is that how you say his name? Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. I've never listened to him. Uh, oh. But now I will. <laughs> I mean, personally, Ciao. for me, I actually felt bad for both of them. <laughs> After I watched the video of the girl, I, I felt bad for who? Oh, the girl. Oh, I didn't see the full I felt video. Bad when she, I mean, I'll you be honest, spark notes. Her, saw, her, her, have you guys seen the apology? No. The part one, did she yeah, drop the part two? I saw, I saw part oh, was one. there a part two? Well, she said it was coming, but it hasn't come. I think she turned off the comments on the TikTok video. <laughs> <laughs> but part one, I just felt I like, think babe, like, where's the accountability? Yeah, her yeah. tone wasn't what apologetic at all. Um, um, she was basically like, 
yeah, obviously, like, you know, like. It sorry. just happens. <laughs> you know <what> I mean? <laughs> okay, oh, sorry. No. I, I want to stop you, Shady. <laughs> no, she was basically like, of course, this has happened in public. And although we've had private conversations, I feel like I should publicly apologize. Mm. Um, you know, that's my man. I bought the ticket. She's actually bought the tickets. I want me and my man to celebrate or whatever. But we spoke about the fact that this is my favorite artist. And. Um, Damn, you memorize her. You he does. I don't know. I'm in no, the you know, Yeah, you do. Well, and um, he, he does this at like, his shows. He brings on girls. So, like, what do you think? Like, if he, if he calls me, like, can I go? And he was they fine with it. For yeah. Him. So they he were. said he was fine with it. But um, obviously, she took it too far. But she didn't really accept the fact that she took it too far. Uh, um, and then she started talking about, oh, let's address the rumors. Like, why did someone say my name was this and my name was oh, yeah, that? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, I yeah, you're, missing, you're missing the point. I, oh, yeah. but I was going to say, you're I remember her talking about point. something. I think, like, she, I think because of silhouette at certain points looked very risque. It literally looked like she was giving the man fellatio. Yeah. So, I think that one video, she kissed him. That's what it looked uh, like. It inside. looked like. So it did, like, obviously it didn't look great. And there's, oh, I've been called up on stage. And there's, oh, I've been called cool. up on stage. No, not like but that they goes. they were also, like, screaming for him to come and get her. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. I think they were both, I think he knew what she he wanted to do. He got embarrassed because he didn't expect this she took to it be too like, far. Yeah, took yeah. it too far. And he oh, valid, left her on that. his wand. If that was me, not, not the girl, male, if I was him. I would just leave right there I and think then. So, yeah. The moment I, so. I saw yeah. them get in that shadow thing, yeah. I would just yeah. like say, and all you can see is a silhouette. So he's just like, don't know what's and going it was on. Blown up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> the picture <laughs> <pictures. laughs> on that silhouette, and all you can just see is. Yeah. I think. Do you know what it is? What's really <laughs> unfortunate is because they're so young. I just feel like. And we've all got such a digital footprint now. Uh, mm. Listen, yeah. when it. I saw the videos <laughs> of a thousand people going bitch. like this, looking at the man, looking at ten thousand no. different hands, face was just he, like, And then there's a videos the post post dance outside with yeah. her and the girls. He's walking, no, no, walk no, no, and no, he no, stayed. No. Oh, bless him. Because you know, oh, like that, you know that video that comes out every New Year's. Oh, Dominic Celeste. I know exactly what you're <laughs> <Yeah>. talking about. <laughs> I mean, he's, he's been let off a couple, been last been couple of couple years. years. Yeah, yeah but we haven't it's like gonna be one of them things where, like, oh, do that you remember that time? Yeah. It's like, it's oh, like the entire world like forgets. Exactly. I, I think she's loving the attention though. Because she doesn't. Yeah. I think it backfired a like, little bit. In that part one, I just felt like she didn't really like. Are they still together? No. She didn't seem like she came uh, over. No. She wasn't coming across as like, oh, like just upset that her relationship's yeah. broken yeah. down. It was just more like, yeah. hear it from the horse's mouth type yeah. thing. I'm yeah. sorry it happened, but it happened. Also, I, I think that she was tried to. Yeah, yeah. I think she tried to spin it in a way where it's like a marketing. It, it, it like benefits her in a, mm. in a major yeah. way, mm. and I don't no, think it worked no. out. But it worked out for him though. Absolutely. Yeah. 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 Everyone knows who She's, MLA is now. No, literally. <laughs> But yeah, and I just think as well, this is like advice to the kitty girls and kitty boys. Mm -hmm. It's never what you think it is. You don't need to go on stage <laughs> when you're that young. <laughs> and you don't need to go to shows in high heels and stand at the front. Mm -mm. Yeah. Yeah. It's just mm -mm. so uncomfortable. But yeah, no, you don't need to do all that because mm -mm. one day you'll look back and be like, why the hell did I do that? And you'll always be known as like, oh, the girl that, that you girl, know. That's, yeah, that's that not what you that. want. Yeah. Obviously, if you're happy with it, that's so fine. Yeah. But it's you just, just so need to think cringy. in the future, like, no, when you got 26, it's going to hurt yeah. her. Job prospects and everything. Because mm, I remember, you know, after the whole Chris Brown fiasco when he was in the UK, I was looking at every. What, what when he beat someone? No, no, no. You know when he when he oh. you know when he performed <laughs> in the UK. <laughs> oh no! When he beat someone. Else. Well, because the last time wasn't he like scrapping in the streets recently? No, I don't know about that ah. one. But I'm talking about you know when he did his tour in the UK. I and remember looking on TikTok for him. every single girl oh, that went oh, up on oh. the stage and like sat in the chair that he like danced on. So I just no, feel like I it wasn't that level. This though, is going to sound really like is. such a contradiction, but I don't mind that as much because, because you're, like you're just sat you're just sat yeah, that's what i'm saying though no, 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 like you're not doing I mean. anything but i think what i'm trying to like highlight is just the visibility yeah of it. no yeah yeah so yeah, imagine yeah. like so i if, if i'm like going out of my way to see who's in the chair at, at tuesday mm. the 29th of july's chris brown concert and then the following day and then the following day i'm looking at that omale video yeah, like, yeah. I'm, I'm i'm watching it it's crazy I'm just thinking about this. It's mad. I feel so bad for him. Yeah. I swear to God. I would die. It will be alright. His ego will be hurt. He'll, he'll be, be like, right. I don't trust girls no more. Obviously, Villain that one story. time. Yeah. 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 Origin, Origin story. <laughs> Origin story. Like, oh. Have no. they, like, they haven't, like, ID'd the guy, have they? they yeah, did. well, did he, he come he up with He was in that high school. He gave him 20K. 
The man's all like 100 like blind, followers. like blind dates, like trying to get him a new girl. If I was in this position, I wouldn't want to be ID. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's winning. He's winning now. He's yeah, right. if I was a girl, oh. I would go ghost. And here, I would Ever. just disappear. I wouldn't do no apology, nothing. Mm. No, because no, just... you would have forgot. Not well, kind of. But yeah, you would have just forgot about her. But she obviously wants to capitalize. Because yeah. what happened was, Kai Sinat invited her on his stream, mm. and she was like, "Oh, I'll only come if you pay me." And he was like, "No." Oh. And then obviously yeah. after when the guy went on, I think he, he got him. like eighty k followers in like minutes yeah. or something. Oh and he paid so him twenty k, and she got he got money. So then she probably thinking, "Damn, oh. I fumbled. <laughs> I got to come I out with my apology." Babe, you're doing this all the wrong way. If you need a PR, let me know. I'll hook you up. <laughs> no, it's just she's definitely commercialising. Yeah. No, in the wrong she way. She knows what she's doing. Terrible. It's all right. We'll oh, see gosh. what comes up. Okay, what's next on the list, girl? Right. Guys, so we're cool. nicking a game awesome. from the ladies. They've got a game called Martini Moment on their podcast by the way while you're here why not listen to their podcast yeah, uh, subscribe. Right. Yeah, everyone subscribe. go and subscribe Follow. to Style in the City podcast Woo! Woo! mocktail moments of the week yay <laughs> oh I need a minute you should we start with you guys oh hang on oh. Oh. the reason why we do it is because sometimes we I think everybody generally only celebrates like really big things. Yeah. But actually there's so many little things that happen every day and during the week that are worth like mm. a little cheer. Yeah. yeah. I agree. I love that. I'm trying be? to think, what's my martini? What have I been getting up to? My martini moment. Oh, mocktail moment. Mo mocktail. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah. Sorry. Sorry. sorry Islamic's here, darling. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> my mocktail moment of the week is the fact that I was on time to DJing on Friday and I was really on time to hear today. Oh, you were early actually. Yeah, early. I, was I early would not think that you're a late babe. <laughs> 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 yeah. they, they were I was, here before. They us. Were here, I was I was embarrassed for myself. So well done I to was you. Like, I can't show her up. You Things like this are trying to be really good, but I'm, get, I'm trying really to be. Who's good. always the late one out of you two? Oh, oh me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I I leave when I'm meant to be there. Yeah. No, you know, like being on time or being early it gives you such a dopamine hit. I don't know what it is. Like when I'm early for work, I'm like, I can literally conquer this entire day. Like, yeah, like I, I got my shit together. Literally, yeah. there's nothing I can't do. <laughs> oh, I love that. What's my mocktail moment of the week? Um, I think it will probably be actually spending time with my family over the weekend. Oh, I was gonna say that. Coffee, me girl. <laughs> yeah, like I don't know. So I don't often get time to like actually spend like extended period of time like more than a day yeah um but i spent the entire weekend there Aww. although i was actually out most of the time like djing and like doing other stuff so really i just slept there but that's not the point with cheersing He's to spending chilled. more time with the mum dad and siblings Aww, that's I lovely that. do you want to go Actually, I was obviously going to say the same thing. <laughs> um, so what did I do on Saturday evening? I went to go and see my cousins, but we went to the shop and bought loads of snacks. And then what did we watch? We watched Love is Blind. Oh, oh my. Let's talk about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, 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 okay. Are you guys up to date? Yeah. 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 I actually yeah. caught up on the whole of yeah. season six in, in on that Saturday evening, just pigging out, watching oh, it, oh, screaming love. at the TV. And that was really fun. <laughs> okay, mine's really cute. Do you guys want to know? Yes. <laughs> okay, so basically, last few, I think last month, was it last month? I quit my job. Woo! Like three months ago, and I got a new job this month. So I started the new job, and basically, what dawned on me is that, like, three or four months ago, I prayed, I like, I made, how can I say da? Supplication. I made a supplication. So, like, I prayed, right? Yeah. So I made a prayer, and I was like, God, please like get me out of this job. I just need something that's gonna be suited to my lifestyle. That's gonna be easy, relaxed. Mm -hmm. And guys, today epiphany. I was sitting in my therapy room, yeah, and I had my feet up. That's the when I sent the picture. I had my feet up with my laptop. It was just such a chill day. Like I wasn't stressed. Oh. I actually enjoyed my job again. Like oh. I wanna help patients again. And then I thought about that situation. I was like, oh my god, I prayed for this and it yeah. came true. Yeah. So nice. I love that. Oh. So, nice. oh, yeah. so yeah. stick to your prayers, on. girls. Yeah. Like, wow, know. like I was so grateful at that moment. And I'm not gonna lie, I've really been struggling with like understanding gratefulness. You know, people say, be grateful, be grateful. It's like, okay, cool, I can say I'm grateful. Yeah. Mm. But like, how do you actually show gratefulness? Like, how do you? Show gratitude, yeah. Mm. It's oh. just like, today I was just like, I'm actually really grateful. Oh. Thank you, God. It's those little things and it makes such a difference as well. Like being in a job that 
fulfilled. Like no one likes working. Like let's mm. just call a spade a spade. Like I don't know anyone that's actually like they're lying. Yeah. Going to work. Like let's be FFR. But it really pays when like you do like what you're doing and things like mm. that. And sometimes when you're in that space where you need to get out, you need to just get out and like right. the rest of it will figure itself yeah, out. Put yeah. But yeah. otherwise, like you'll just end up in a hole that is not I'm nice. So mm. It was crazy. Like I was, I always used to say to Carlton, like I hate my job. I hate this job. I don't like it. And like now I like my job again. Like yes. I like my passion again. But you oh. can see the actual difference yeah. in the way that you are. Like you're not like as anxious, no. you're not as sad. No, I'm happy. You're just a happy girl. Good. <laughs> I, I love. That's like my mocktail moment. Yeah. 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 You see, there's a real difference when you like leave something that's just not nice. Mm. Honestly, it just like emanates on your face, your yeah. body, your mannerisms. You're just, you're just back to <sighs> the old hole. Though. I am. Okay. I love it. Let's move on. Love is blind, guys. Please. Oh my. Oh, I need to start. Should we take a deep breather? Yeah. Okay. Who should we start with? Should we start with Chelsea and Jimmy? <laughs> oh my, I have a confession. Wow. Mate, I was, well, I was like, I don't know, maybe from like episode two to like episode five. You see that face. I thought Jimmy and Jeremy were the same guy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm watching and I'm like, only you, one person, you want five women. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> and then so at the funny. reveal, I was like, Oh, oh, you're just you're so doing that thing rude. where you think they all look the same. That's so rude of you. <laughs> I think even Jessica. I mean, reverse. <laughs> <laughs> that was I mean, they do it all the time. Yeah. So. That's jokes. So oh. I need to get a reminder of what they all look like because I Jimmy forget. Is, uh, uh, Jimmy is the best. He's the one that wanted. He wanted Megan Fox. Yeah. Right? yeah. yeah. And, and then he, he got... actually had Megan Fox, but fumbled the real Megan Fox. Yeah. She, first of all, when that girl said you're going to choke. She's like, no, no, because no, but (laughs) (laughs) like, she said you're gonna need that. Obviously, beauty's in the the beholder. (laughs) Oh yeah, she did say. (laughs) She goes, you're gonna need an effort. She was livid because you know why? She's rude, rude. yeah. Because she saw Chelsea (laughs) and she's She's like, you can't compare. And And that's rude. Why is she using these conditions against him? Not the epipen. No, literally. She's diabetic. Not diabetic. Do you think he's got allergies? Yeah, maybe he's there because why did she say that? It was such a specific. Yeah. Such a bad specific. If I didn't have it, I'd be like, I what don't the fuck are you talking like, What are you talking about, you freak? Yeah, <laughs> they might have had a conversation. Oh, that it was specific, made me die. I was like, about what? allergies in the pod. She no. couldn't believe. She was jaw dropped. Like, like, she was like, but obviously, it's blind, down, though. It's she blind. doesn't know. Yeah. But a lot of people on the internet are saying that. Chelsea had a natural real connection with Trevor and they suspect that for because of her ego, she, she thought, went let for, me go yeah. for Jimmy. Yeah, because, because the Chelsea. other girl wanted yeah. him. Yeah, I mean, because oh. of So because Megan. Chelsea was Megan insecure. <laughs> so they feel, the internet basically feels like Chelsea is very much insecure oh, in the way oh, that she is. So it's like, I agree with that, right? Textbook insecurity. And yeah. because of that insecurity, it's pushed her to basically compete with Jess to take Jimmy because she feels like if she gets Jimmy, she's one over Jess. She's gonna have a And then that validation shot. of being the pretty girl is finally there. No, he is, but she's no. gonna need a lot of therapy to work After through. that situation. How can he say to her, she's like, tell me something nice about me. He's like, you have nice teeth. teeth. He's like, that's the first thing I noticed in your teeth, you got like bunny rabbit. If you <laughs> don't pack your bag right now and, what? I can't Like, tell me you that. hate me about telling me you hate me. That oh was, my that god! That was men. I was oh. so shocked. And when he insane. called her, and he was like, and she said something like, "Oh, I liked your eyes" or something, and she's like, "That's cute." That's what she I said, said that is twice. Cute. She said that and twice. And he's like, "They're actually they're cute." <laughs> and he was like, "There's something else," but it's like, I don't want to say. And he was talking about her rack. You know when he called her oh. clingy as well? That really affected yeah. oh, me, guys. That's gosh. so mean. No, sorry. Do you know what I realized about Love Is Blind? So many adults, and I tweeted this, lack like simple communication skills, Mm. simple comprehension. He said, I felt like you were being clingy for these past two days. I'm not saying you are a clingy person. And she just heard, you're a clingy person. Yeah. And she ran with it. She's like, but fuck you, I'm clingy. She yeah. And she cries every two seconds. Literally. Babe, you're not stable. And that's okay. Yeah. But you need to go and sort it out. Wrong show. <laughs> Wrong show. <laughs> at no point she in has that, cried so much. Yeah, at no point in that conversation did she just stop and like mm. process what he was saying. At all. She just heard what she wanted to hear. Which was And that conversation with A D when he when he commented on A D being stacked. That was so and instead of like 
I don't know. She could have had. She could have swapped the conversation. conversation. Yeah. She was like, "Yeah, yeah, Ad, he said that you're stuck." But it's the way the camera was showing, like, you know, that her <laughs> at the bar, and then him, like, continuing to talk oh to AD. I was just dying for her in that moment. But I don't think it was anything big. No. I don't think so either. Like, I would have a conversation, pardon me, like, if I had a partner. Mm. I can imagine that. <laughs> <laughs> um, it can and, happen. Um, it can happen. Like, I would be like, yo, babe, like, check out my girl. Like, her yeah. thing is, wow. Mm. Or, like, whatever, yeah. whatever. And I would have that conversation. Like, I get where she's coming from. She's like, yeah, like, it's chill. But you was not saying that because it's chill. Like, yeah. you, that made you feel the type of way. To, and yeah. you, brought, you said, I tried to make an uncomfortable situation comfortable. Absolutely. No, you made it uh, more. You made it worse. Yeah. How are you shouting? Yeah, 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 she's stacked. AD. Yeah, like she, right. she wasn't it Chelsea that even brought up that conversation? Was it Chelsea or was it Jimmy that brought it no, up? No, Jimmy brought it up. Oh, I see. And I don't like the sexualization eye. of AD yeah. mm. that's been happening. Yeah. yeah. The whole flip being, being flipped. What is whatever. that? Oh my God. I, what really was, I had to that Google either. that, you know. Oh, so I didn't even think to Google It's basically. You slap a boob like that. Like, who yeah. does that? Who does Americans, that? Americans, I suppose. Oh, so it's flip bean. Yeah, flip, flip I guess a bean is like the nip. Oh, okay. So. They said they wanted to do that. So somewhere. that crazy it, woman, Laura. Thank you. Yeah. Which one is that one? She like? The blonde one. She's the blonde with one. Jeremy. Jeremy's. Oh, the ones that you're mixing up. She's a bit nuts yeah. still. Yeah. <laughs> she tells Jeremy, "Oh, when you see AD, flip her bean or something, whatever the." Weird. Weird. Very strange. Weird. Why like, would you say that? And if that's an inside joke between the girls, obviously a girl tells her man everything, but it's them. That's weird. Yeah, like, yeah, so weird. So then he's girls. obviously come and be like. What does flip the bean mean? And then Aidy's like, "What the hell? Like, why? Like, uh, and she's like, "Yeah, like, Lord told me to come and do this to you." And she's like, "This is." But weird. he's dumb as well. Why are you saying that? Why yeah. are you saying? That? And Clay was like, "What's up, my man? <laughs> 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 what you say? <laughs> flip the what?" <laughs> Yo. No, I love that though. Wrap it up. Yeah. 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 Like, what oh, are you talking about? That's nasty. Oh, honestly, yeah. I love that from yeah. Kay. But it was just such a weird thing to say out loud. So and bizarre. I feel like, what's his name? Jeremy didn't even at one point, like I don't know if they'd been drinking a lot or whatever, who knows, but like, he literally didn't, there was no foresight. Like how would this conversation yeah, go no. if I at said all. it out loud? But he's a bit like that. Like he's a bit, I don't think he's well, with us. He's not. Yeah. <laughs> I, mean, I was gonna <laughs> say something. I was gonna, oh, I stopped myself. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah, like he is a bit weird, isn't he? He is. Listen, let's talk about Jeremy. Five a.m. What are you doing? Mm. What are you doing? Five a.m. I was in the car park just talking. Why are you lying? She was for? like, "Don't send me <laughs> your location." Five o'clock in the morning. I got the receipts. <laughs> they right here. It was all a lie. No, I love. I love how she said it out there. She was like, "Tell me, tell me more." Yeah. 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 She was like, "No, you weren't." Loved He's it. He's so dumb she though. Knew. Why you would won't. you send, send your location, location and not think no, no one's gonna check? Guys, you know the J calls up. She knows. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, she, <laughs> knows. <laughs> I, no, she knew. I know she knows. And she just sat there. The whole and time, said, literally, the face was bet. just like. Like, he no had nothing to expression. say. And he was there with his hands. He cast. was fuming. He was like, oh, fuck, man. Like, but you've got it caught. really backfired. Because he thought he'd do, do reverse that. psychology. Yeah, men he love to do that reverse angle. Like, I'm mad at you because you don't trust me. Yeah, he exactly. didn't know that she Calm had down. the entire receipt. She down. made such a good point when she was like, why would I want to be with someone where they have to send me their location? Yeah. And it's so true. Like, he did a double bluff. No, no, he's weird. He said something like, I was in the alleyway. <laughs> like, yeah, like, like the bar's here yeah, and then there's an alleyway. And she's like, you're lying. She's in the alleyway of the lost and found. Like, what? The story like, just took so many turns. She was like, you lying. <laughs> you know what I read on Twitter that apparently he left his phone in the car, so his location on his phone would have said like wherever he was, the lost and found. But because he was wearing an Apple Watch, that picked up that he was at Sarah Jane's house. Oh, so he parked his car, got in her the car. car. You. No, it's a plan. Calculated. <laughs> oh my God, I do love it. It's he like Bloody this, Apple so Watches. Bloody. I know, I know. I didn't even know Apple Watches could do that. Yeah, yeah the Apple Watch snitched. They do. Oh. Sorry guys, hello, elephant in the room. I oh. can't believe that my two favorites just broke up. Tyreek and Michelle. Are we sure? Are we talking about Tyreek and Are we talking about Tyreek and <laughs> What? <laughs> who's your two favorites? Hey, what, who's your two? Guys, I'm talking about love is blind. Oh yeah. my god, Kenneth! <laughs> Kenneth, oh, was Kenneth, was your Kenneth was your face! Kenneth was your face! Kenneth was your face! No, I'm actually in no. shock right now. Are you okay? I You're trusted so you in judgment, but not more. Was, I was like, who? Who's your fave? I thought you were talking about Ty and Ella. 
What the fuck? Why did that you come out? They're broken up. Love Island. Oh. <laughs> oh, you didn't care about it. <laughs> Kenneth. Oh. You, Kenneth was your no, friend. No, guys. Sorry, but they had such a lovely No, connection. Kenneth was in lying. The pods, in, in the, the pods. pods. Yeah, in real yeah. life. And then in real life, I that, hated him. Yeah. He had he that was conversation. Like, his when they have a conversation, he goes on his phone. She's crying. He's like, you are right? Yeah. No. <laughs> he did not even get up to hug her. He walked up the stairs. He said, come pick me up. He called his friend before. While that conversation was happening. And he had his bags ready packed. Shall I tell you what rattled him? I think it's that conversation he had with AD. Yeah. And she said to him, how are you going to raise black babies? Yeah, he's, he's like, you know, I'm pro-black, but like, she's like, you can be pro-black and have a white woman. Yeah. yeah. And, and then, then every time he sees AD and Clay, he's like, black love. Yeah. They, I'm he telling you, he got triggered. He was, he, when they were like kissing or something and he was like, yeah, turn me on or something. Oh, yeah, kind of <laughs> 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 Is he still your fave? <laughs> Is he your fave now? No, I love that no, he's no, your real life. Yeah, I'm like, sorry, no. I want to know let why. Me, let me, let me, is he your fave, Amber? <laughs> let me disclaimer. I just meant like in the pods, like it was so wholesome, genuine yeah, and yeah. wholesome. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. these two teachers. And she's like, I don't give a damn what color you is. You mm, my man and yeah. I love you. Mm. Like whatever accent is. And I was like, wow. And they saw each other and I was just like, oh my God, I mm. love, I didn't like the way, like he was really, really bad. Mm. He was so unmotionally He was like, unavailable. so unavailable when they was on that boat and she's like. I know, it was so like silent. It was silent. And then he's like. I love his breeze. Maybe he just wasn't attracted to Maybe her. Maybe he just wasn't yeah. yeah. Guys, that's why Sorry, I do Sorry, who's think? your favourite? I don't have no favourite. I think they're trash. And that boy, Amy, is that her name? What's no, I don't like any of them. Know. Do you know the only couple that's actually like cute? The, 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 the Latina girl. Oh. Yeah. yeah. And the guy with, with the hair. Blonde yeah, they're oh, the they're guy cute. obsessed with birth control. Yeah. Oh. Like, no, yeah, no. Yeah, it was a like, I'm usually used to um like darker guys, like darker skin, darker hair. I said, I don't know what you're doing. You guys are getting along quite well they though. Yeah. I'll just offer them, yeah, the- They actually, can I ruin it for you guys? Yeah, How sure. do you know this? Wait, <laughs> saw it on TikTok. <laughs> all right, oh no, because on. like one year's lapsed since the show, hasn't it? Yeah, yeah they're, they're, all they're not together. No, they are. They're, <gasps> ma- they're actually married. Oh! <laughs> okay. Everyone else does. Oh. Oh. You, you knew that. Yeah, no. I mean, you accepted that. So are they Come all on. gonna say no at the altar? That's not. Except, I think accept- some of them do, and then it just yeah, flops off. Oh, that's true. But do you guys actually believe <clears throat> love is blind? <coughs> for oh, me, no. no. I was thinking about when they did the London one, and I was like, oh, could I go on that show? But Wait, is I it out there? Yeah. No, no they, I think they're having issues casting, apparently. <laughs> it's <We> London. <laughs> <laughs> well, all UK or London. We can't even date when we see, can see each other. No, no literally. Date behind the post. But I, yeah. can't, I can't hide my facial expressions. So if I come out and I'm not attracted <laughs> to them, it's a burrito <laughs> wrap. Like, turn around, I'm out of here. I'll be, <laughs> like, so I'll be like, yo, Jeff. Producer Jeff, get me out of here. Um, act. Your love lick. is not blind. <laughs> <laughs> I can't see. <laughs> love is not blind. Yeah, no, I think it's is. very difficult. Yeah, you, you know, know, like people online were saying that this show was just created for Cameron and Lauren to meet. Yeah. yeah. And that's it. But I can understand like building a love for someone without seeing them. Mm. Like I can totally like get that side of it, but it's like, you, I either have to never see for the rest of my life. And then yeah. you carry on and that then way. That's yeah, it. yeah, yeah. Yeah. We can be pen pals. Yeah. yeah. But it's like, Besties. who wants a pen pal? No. Do you know yeah. what I mean? No, love is not blind, it's guys. Not. It seems yeah. like, like being attracted is one of the main yeah. things of falling in love. And I do understand sometimes they say attraction grows, but it's like, yeah, it grows when I've met you first. Exactly. And, you're ban- yeah. and you got good banter. Yeah. If, yes, if you've if got Jenna Sequa with the personality, you can glow yeah. up a little bit. But you still have to grow on me. I don't know how Cam and Lauren did it. Oh, I guys, they them. were saying I love you like two weeks I in. Know. It was so, so cute. cute. Yeah, they were lovely. And do you know what? She, what do we call it when you're, when we're like, we can just like make the man what you want it, like what you want him to be, like change the way he dressed in. Oh, yeah, like yeah, that. yeah. But she created her ideal man. She did. Yeah. And he looks good now. What's it called? The pre, the post girlfriend? What's oh, that? girlfriend effect. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. That's Lauren. <laughs> Thank Lauren you. Right, ladies, we are going to quietly move on. Yes. We are star ladies. What was your most tragic? fashion moment <gasps> era. Oh my God, love. Oh, do you want to say yours? Oh, do you want, do you want to say oh, yours? Oh, oh, yeah, at the end. Oh, oh yeah, at the end. Yeah. Oh, I don't yeah. even want, oh. <laughs> okay, so I go. Yeah. She goes, someone goes, the hijab layers. She goes, no, I'm still traumatized, basically. Is that when everyone used to do the different yeah. colors? Yeah. Oh, different colored layers. Listen, the girlies used oh, to yeah. love that. Fashion. I used to wear my hijab like this. <laughs> 
is what we used to see. Like some girls would like tie it back here and then have this bit coming round. No. Oh, no, and the, the big bun one, yeah, the, like, the big Amy Winehouse yes, vibe. Yes. Yes. I love it because it's a form of expression. That's what fashion yeah, is. Yeah, as well. Expression. So it's like doing different things with something that is supposed to be a bit more simple. No, is it called a hijab? Wait, I don't want to use the wrong uh, step. Um, <laughs> it's hijabi. Yeah. I almost became a hijabi in year nine. Yeah. Oh. Really? What happened? Um, right, how do I say this so respectfully? <laughs> so I identify as Muslim, I'm half Turkish. Yeah. So, um, Mar- Marhaba. Marhaba. Do you actually know, do you, do you watch Turkish shows? Oh you, you yeah, yeah of course, Turkish. I speak fluent Turkish. Oh. Yeah. I've got bad Turkish shows. Let's oh my God, we'll talk about it. Um, Ashkum, anyways. Mm-hmm. Um, and <laughs> neden, I was neden. like, I just, I just, <laughs> <laughs> I really got into like, my religion Mm. and I feel like that happens when you're like at that kind of age and all of the like Muslim girls and boys like at school were like yeah like just come pray with us and this and that so I'd go pray and then but I think I took it to a place where it was this is how I don't want it to sound rude not extreme but it was like uh, uncomfortable you did it too much too quickly Oh, yeah, okay. too much too quickly. But I was like, that's it. I'm no, ready. No, but we can all like gonna wear relate, the hijab. Relate, like, yeah. I was literally like so close to, and then I just didn't. In the end, I don't know. I think that lasted about like two weeks, and then I was like, oh, whatever. Yeah. But um, but I just remember being like, oh my god, I'm gonna have all these like colorful hijabs. And oh. I, remember, <laughs> I remember one of the girls like gifted me like my first hijab. I still have it. <laughs> and, it's oh, got, oh, and it's got little like nice. diamond oh, stuff on it. But oh, you know, you know the ones where you wear it. And yeah. It's got yeah. The but what you said about um doing it very quickly is so relatable because we found that when because we had a bint phase as well that's, that's what, what we call, we call it, it a bint, bint phase. phase like when we started like getting into islam a bit more it's like we just wanted to know everything yeah. in one mm-hmm. go because it's so addictive and i find journey. it hard to express so i usually just don't say that i am because you're like well what, what how did that you do this? and i'm like oh Turkish Muslims are very different to like other Muslims, yeah. you know, yeah. we're a bit more liberal and this mm-hmm. and that, it doesn't take away, but it's just so hard mm. to like. But being Muslim doesn't that. mean, I feel like a lot of people get this wrong. Um, being Muslim isn't just wearing a headscarf, like you can, you can be Muslim mm. so many facets. This is what it's I mean. It's all about what yeah. you have in your heart. Exactly. So. But yeah, Don't I get worry. the hijab situ. <laughs> <laughs> um, someone goes, those skirt trousers that were attracted, that were tra- attached together. I, 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 quite, I quite, quite like a skirt like trouser. Me too. I used to like the fact that it covered my bum. Yeah. <laughs> I've never worn one in my life. I'm just looking for one yeah. in a minute. Yeah. Really? Yeah. 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 Guys, we got yeah. fashion girlies, so you know, <laughs> let's not, okay, let's not. Or you can just wear a dress over trousers yeah. or a skirt over Let me ask you guys a question, let's pause. Yeah. How do you guys find your personal style? Oh. Oh, oh is that so a jarring so question? Well. I don't even know it. Oh, it's just She's who just so I am. Quirky. It's who I wake up to be that yeah. day. Yeah, I and agree. how like I. That's like pretty always says. Sorry, I'm speaking on behalf of you. She's Sorry. like, I can't plan what I'm gonna wear. Like I'm more of a planner than she is. If we got mm. an event, I'm like, right, I won't. She's like, because I don't know who I'm gonna be. Mm, yeah, really? and that's the personal style. Yeah, because when I was at uh, on the weekend at my parents, obviously I packed clothes. I woke up on Sunday. I was like, this is not me. No, but that's what I had to wear. <laughs> 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 I think. Think less about personal style or trends and just buy things that you like yeah. and wear yeah. things that make you feel good. Mm. I think people go wrong when they're buying into trends. They feel like, oh, this is how I want to dress. And then they wear it and they feel uncomfortable mm. because a lot of, if you look at a lot of like the style icons or fashion mm. icons, like Rihanna, for example, I went through like a Pinterest hole of looking at some of the stuff she wore. And when you look at it, you're like, that looks really weird. Mm. <laughs> but she carries it with such confidence yeah. that it's stylish. Yeah. So it's not necessarily what you're wearing. It's just more like how you're wearing it yeah. and just be confident in whatever it is you choose to wear. And then through that, Valid. you just- yeah, and like an adapting it. trends to you. So you don't have to follow a trend like word for word, bar oh for bar. TikTok mm. is so draining. Yeah. Yeah. And it's like, you can adapt it to you and you don't have not because not every trend is going to be like a thing yeah mm. um like the milkmaid tops like what was that about but i was in that trend mm. like mm. what the hell i don't even remember what that was that was like the square it's like the neck square and it's like a bit frilly yeah yeah yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> like little house and of it's like, what that, we doing? that didn't even suit me but i had so many of them mm. because oh it was like 
I think it's just like knowing what is for you and what yeah. like, what can you let pass and what can't you let pass. Like, yeah. Kind of thing. And it's okay to let things go. Mm. Oh, I yeah. love that. Oh, that's, that's such a great answer. <laughs> right, quick question. Someone goes white jeans in 2020. Oh oh, <laughs> 2020. And like dolly yeah. shoes. No, but wait. Skinny jeans. Like skinny, skinny, white, skinny, white, skinny white, jeans white, white, jeans. white, 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 for me though that's one yeah, of those that's that the thing, like, that it's coming back and I'm okay isn't gonna look good on yeah. me and that's fine <laughs> yeah. because those type of belts the big back yeah mine always and ride yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and, and that's what we mean by not everything is, is you style. look silly yeah. yeah I can appreciate it and be like I would love yeah. to wear that I'm glad someone else is wearing it and not me yeah oh my God. Do you, did you guys like actually go through a, a thing where you like hold on to things in case they come oh back yeah I've got my Jeffrey Campbell's they said no they're coming way. back yeah <laughs> yeah yeah, I still do. What do I have? Mm, you I keep don't. a lot of stuff. I keep a lot you got like your Timberlands that you've yeah, never wear. Yeah, I've got like my Tim, like things like that. I'll keep mm. yeah. and like li- like my Levi's, like good jeans yeah. and stuff. I'm like, mm. I've actually come back never round. bought an, a nice pair of Levi's in my life. I'll be honest though, I think I'm afraid they they won't have my size, but we'll see. But mm. you just have go go, and they're really helpful. And Levi's yeah. give as well, so you always really? have to get them a bit tight. Because now the Levi's I bought, oh, they're stretched out. Go Bista Village, really they're like sixty quid there. Oh. That's the side. That's Ooh. how much they are. Like Zara jeans are mm. like the same price. Um, just go because they they literally do it by waist and by mm. by length. Oh my god! It's a jeans company. Yeah, they, they will. They will yeah. have sizes. Right, and the last one is Kim K with a bin bag outfit. When did Kim Which K wear a bin bag outfit? Is it a Met Gala? The Met Gala look when she wore that what, the black? all black the Balenciaga one. Oh, oh, oh my god! Are you like guys excited one. for Met Gala? Yeah. yeah. Can yeah. you explain yeah. the theme? Season beauty. It's like no. They it's keep changing the name beauty. of it. Yeah. It's like it's, something it's like beauty awakening or something. Yeah. Oh, sorry, that's like where that. I got sleeping beauty from. Like, <laughs> beauty, beauty awakening. awakening. No, the Garden of Time. No, but no, they like changed beauty. it. I think they've changed it because it's saying the theme is Garden of Time. What does that even God, mean? I, like I swear to God, it was literally. It was. We spoke about it. It was like. Beauty reawakened, magic. Oh, was that the last one? I'm so confused. No, that know. might have been the last one actually. I think we my favorite one was the yeah. one they they did loads of Christian stuff. Lots yes. of Catholic. Yes, yes. That, that was a good one. Yeah, oh, that was God. the only one that I remember. I, I wouldn't say Frank Ocean. Two, two or years ago. Stunning. I don't remember. Yeah. If I see that, that was a maybe. really really that good, was a good one, one though. That I remember. <laughs> okay, um, he used to be in a hit band called Take That. He was the lead singer, Robbie Williams. <laughs> the blonde guy, what's his no, name? No, li- moving on, moving on. I can't read your handwriting. Some when someone I- is humorous, what's another word for humorous? Funny. Thank you. Um, I can't read your handwriting. Oh, I knew I should have. There's described. a there's these are a type of shoes that loads of people wear, and he used to be a basketball player. Jordans. Thank you. Um, Don't ooh. say thank you. You're wasting time. Shut <laughs> up, you cow. Um, you fly this into the sky and it goes I'm to okay. space. Okay, cool. When <laughs> I. <laughs> How okay, many did you cool. get? <laughs> I didn't get two. She's like, I got nice. one, two, okay, three. Okay, cool. That's one second. Yeah, she's trying to blame me. What was the first one, Gary Barlow? Garlic Barlow. Garlic Barlow. Yeah. Yeah. Wasn't Robbie Williams was in... Um, he Tom wasn't in Take That. He that, was in Take That. He wasn't in Take Yeah, because yeah, yeah. he had main character syndrome. Yeah. yeah. Was I not good then? Yeah, it yeah. was good, yeah. Oh, um, 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 Monarchy, right now. Queen? No. Print King Charles? Yeah. Uh, what the hell is that? Okay, I'm skipping <laughs> that one. Oh, so basically you, you sleep on it and pillow. It's, it's not a single one. It's a double and pillow. A, and you lie down on it. Bed, double bed, queen Thank size. You. King. Um, when, you're, when, when you're not taking something to someone, you're... Receiving. No, you're... Another word of taking something to someone. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> These were really hard. Wasn't, wasn't Aero Police? I had to skip that one. It was bringing. Oh, bringing. Oh. No. Why do, you, why do you do this? I don't know. I don't know. We've no. got the confidence. No, no don't, right. don't get too gas. No, this this your last one, yeah. Oh no. Oh, oh no. Come, come, come hard. Come hard. Go. Um, this is um a guy <laughs> who used to fly Tinkerbell. He Peter never Pan. Grows. Yes. Oh my God, what's the right? Read quicker. That's not what you said to me. So this is a fruit and it's yellow. Orange. And it's, it's really nice. Like it's just a tropical fruit. It's got little 
Melon, pear, watermelon. The really nice tasting one that apparently makes your juices taste nice. A lemon. Oh, oh, oh my God. Oh. Carry on now. Oh, are we I still got time? I don't know. Oh, she's pineapple. Pineapple. I don't know any of these. Pineapple. Can you I said orange. Mango. I thought it was melon. No, I didn't say orange. What was it? said a fruit, it, yellow fruit. Pineapple. But you said orange fruit. I said yellow. yellow. Oh, I thought it was orange. <laughs> you, you wanted to hear yellow. I had Can I just say <laughs> the other things that are on this? Yeah. Arctic circle. What? Bristle. Gobbling. If I describe gobbling, that would have been hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, my mind is in the gutter. And then a Brontosaurus. Yeah. Oh, you don't. You don't. Well, How so many did we get then? two? <laughs> did she not get pineapple? <laughs> no. no. Okay, oh, they ready? folded twice. Okay. Ready? Go. Oh, that's it. We can't do any more. Oh shit, there's nothing on this one. Oh, Sorry. Got to start again. <laughs> okay, okay. Ready? Ready? Go. <clears throat> um. Oh. Um. Jamaica. Caribbean. No. <laughs> Island gas. Oh, I just can't do this. Send shop. All right, we, we take the, um, it's what you take when you do your groceries. A bag, thing. shopping bag, yes. tote bag. Um, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, no one. Oh, for it. Hurry up. Oh, How many Get seconds, how many seconds the on the one. clock? Eight, oh, come on. <laughs> the next one, we can't beat them. Yeah. <laughs> I'd say we can't beat it then. Do you know what? It's just. Who won? My brain just went for Who won? I know. Well, you know, you know, you know, you know what? The thing is, I started to think about Squidward, <laughs> and then I couldn't get my <laughs> Oh my God. Squidward. <laughs> Why did Hate I say that? Gaza? That's Gaza what I said. I made them, and I was like, inoculating. Gaza. <laughs> oh yeah, shit. Free, free. No, because oh I want to get on How do you describe Peyton? Wait. Oh, you know the what? shoes, the shoes that you used to wear when you're a little girl, buckle shoes, clock shoes, oh, Peyton. Fashion girlies would know. Right, who won, who won? Who won? Who I just saw girls there and I was like, oh, oh how do I see a movie like, oh, like, Vash Patel says it in the song. Next one, next one, Vash. Guys, <laughs> we need to have you back here for like, oh, no, the listen, final yeah. round. Yes. Yes. Can I just say we won because of my discovery. Yeah, I'll tell you that. Yeah. Thank I'll you very much. So this is like an ongoing thing now. Like, we're we're in, so one nil to you lot. Oh, God. That was bad of me. You've got to come back. Yeah, we're going to yeah, you got to yes. us and we'll do, um, we'll see how good oh, you guys, are. Guys, we had so much fun. Oh, there you go. I want to talk so more long oh, oh, sorry. Next, Next time, time so much in. Yeah. Yeah. So much no, but this was fun. This was so fun. This, this is going to be my martini moment. Yeah, that's it. Oh, I oh, would do a joint one. Thanks. Yeah, because I I didn't want to say it when I was on here because I want to save it for ours. Oh. On the podcast, ne- on the next week's podcast, we're going to be here in Salem, the city. Tari saying, no martini, my friend. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, honestly, oh, it's, it's been, been amazing. Been... That is the end of our episode. Guys, do you want to just actually know, we're just going to put all of their details in the bio. Please go and listen to them. Support your girlies. Because yeah. you know what? Girls support girls. Yeah. You know what I mean? You know what I oh, mean? wait, can I just quickly do a... Go on. A shameless plug. Go, Go on. on. We have our first ever live show. <gasps> yeah. Oh my God, I'm so excited to talk to you about that. Okay, let's He's go, like, let's go. Kick talk. Really quickly, first live show, April 21st. Go and grab your tickets, there's literally not many. Yeah, not many left, but, but you can come. You can come. When, is come. It? when is it? April 21st, 21st. on okay. Sunday. Make sure it's after Ramadan. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. we're going to get our tickets. <laughs> so, yeah, can uh, we get come through, and just it's going to be a lot of fun of us chatting shit, per usual. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're is this coming. Your, is this your first live show? Yeah. yeah. No, we have to we're coming. We're going to need some advice. Yeah. No, we don't know what we're doing. No, you got this. Honestly, girls. You guys got this, honestly. You've got this. But yeah, sorry, shameless plug. That was all. Well done, well done, no, it's really good. And you guys got a patron? Yes. Yes, we do. It's called Dating Diaries, where we basically put all the juicy stuff behind a paywall because yeah. you can't be giving it out for free. No, no. we, we can't have these the guys up. listening. They're like, why do you talk about me on the podcast? It's yeah. like, excuse me, this, this is a safe space. <laughs> so <laughs> we have to start doing it private. She said we get Yama. <laughs> yeah, no, we, we were. We were. They were like, oh, yeah, someone said it to me. Da, da, da. No, yeah, because yeah. we definitely had to come on the Oversharers podcast because we are Oversharers. Oversharers. Mm. No, literally. And, and the here is like, we're back. hidden, like, it's fine. Like, yeah. Who's yeah, <laughs> gonna find us? <laughs> Guys, you've got to come back, honestly. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. I want to talk about dating diaries. Yeah. Yes. We'll, just we'll do a part two. Yeah, we need to know about two. DJing. We need to know about oh fashion weeks. Oh we need God, to know about so your favorite much. red carpet looks. <gasps> like, literally. We need to know everything. This needs to be a reoccurring segment. Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. We'll do it. Oversharers, X Island Diaries. And then. One day we'll have a joint live show, maybe. Oh yeah. my God, yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. We're so cute. <laughs>
<laughs> oh, we're sorry to hurt your ears, guys. Sorry. But that is the end of the episode. We love you guys so much. Thank you so much. And make sure you subscribe to the patron. Because what are you doing? Like, Both of our patrons. Both of our patrons. And also, make thank you. Make sure you subscribe to the YouTube. What else am I forgetting? Don't forget to download the episode, Go on. like the episode, Boom. subscribe to the YouTube. Boom. Yeah, all of that. Well, Smash that. the like button. Smash the like button. Leave a review. Leave a review. Yeah. Leave some five stars. That's whatever you listen on. Go on. There you go. All right then. Bye. Bye. Bye, guys.